This is so tired. He closed the door, sit down. I did ask him, Manny, you really want to be in TV? He says, yeah. I told him, I called Jimmy Kimball. You know, you'll be on this TV. And next day he was shot, four o'clock he was in my shop. And we did a clip and we sent Jimmy. And after that he went to Jimmy Kimball. <laughs> I'm happy for him. <laughs> You, you know, know what? It, He's it, a good man. He it, deserves it. Well, you know, uh, Manny Pacquiao is number one. Famous. Yeah, it's very famous now. Um, but you know what? A lot of help from other people like yourself. Oh. He helps himself. He's wonderful. He's doing a great job. Yeah. I'm very happy to have a friend like him. Sometimes when I see on TV, Oh my God, he's my friend. I know him. I will cry. I'm so excited. Because I know how he started. When I see him, I'm very, very happy for him. He's wonderful. I love him dearly. Your friends, I mean, they know you know Manny Pacquiao. In day one. I mean, they, they always asking you for autographs, pictures with him. But, you know, right now you say it's very hard to do. But he still does for me. Anytime I want. Still. <laughs> still. As soon as I call him Manny, he will stop and look at me. He give me a hug and kiss. He's good. Actually, I've seen him just greet you without you having to call him. <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> yes, I do. But we have to call him. He ignores us. But you, however, you just look at him. He just goes right to you. <laughs> he knows I'm his best friend. He knows me too. How I know him, he knows me. We have a long time, 10 years relationship. Yeah. And plus, he's adorable. I call him, he's all right now, congressman, and I hope one day he'll be president in Philippines. He loves his people. I see love boxer, but there is no one like Manny. He loves his Philippine people, and he loves his country. He's willing to do everything for his country. He admires me that way, very much. When I met him, he was a small, right now he's muscle. When I saw TV with many, oh my God, I get excited. Has he always been generous even with the, the people in the early days, was he generous? Yes, yes. He gives money to homeless people. You know how he does? He takes his seat belt, he takes the money from his valley, he turns his head and he says thank you. No one can see it. I mean, he's very class. In day one, he was like that. That was before he was famous. Yes. He's always nice. He gives tea and he never curses. He always says thank you. His religion, he prays before his food. This is such a different guy. I see a lot of boxers, they curse. This guy, I never heard of him. No, he's nice. You, can you explain to us when you first met him? I heard you told me that he used to live, have an apartment just around the corner. So, can you just elaborate on that story a little bit? Oh, he, we, we didn't talk. We just say hi and bye every day, three, four times. And then he would run around the... The blocks, <laughs> yes, yes. We know him as a face, as you know. We say hi, and I used to give him haircut. And yeah. he said he spoke to the homeless people too as well. Yes, he does with everybody, yeah. Right now, he's talking with the governor, president, all big things, but still he talks with the homeless. Either this time, I saw he give him forty dollars to one of the rappers that was singing. That guy, he came, man, I love you, and he had the forty bucks. He does. He does. Thank you so much for sharing. He's this a special. Story. Thank you. Thank you guys for having me.